sister girl Sophia, a 17 year old Filipino who does beauty and lifestyle videos. But for today, we're going to be unboxing another laptop. As you can see from the, the thumbnail, we're going to be unboxing the Lenovo ThinkPad 15. This is the laptop inside the box. So as you can see, there's a mouse and there's a flash drive over here because these are like free, I think. We're going to go right ahead and unbox it because we're going to show you guys the specs of this laptop. Pa. I have a wooden table right here. Let's put it here. There's so much space. This is the wireless mouse that comes with it. Does it focus? I hope it's focus. I think right here it's already open because there's no tape anymore because we tried, tried to look what's worse here. This is what's inside the box. This is the laptop and I think this is the charger. So let's go get it. Over here, we have this. I don't know what it's called. I'm not sure what it's called, but I think it's the wire for the charger. The cord. Oh my God. And we have this. I think this is where you plug this one. This one, you plug this one. So this, it goes to like the charger. What is this? This is a Type-C port. Oh, <laughs> This is okay. This is 15 inches as as what's written on the specs. Oh my god, oh my god. Oh my gosh. This is in color mineral gray. Oh my gosh. So we have the wood table here. So here's the laptop. Um picket ya! It's said to be 1.7 to 3.5 kilograms. And this one, it says in the box that, that it's 2.69 kilograms. Later, I'll show you this better and take a picture of it and put it on screen so you can show, see it better. Now we have here the laptop. Oh my gosh. It's not lightweight. As you can see, the width of this laptop, with, with, with what? <laughs> the width of this laptop is so like long. Let me give you a closer view of the laptop. This is the laptop. I haven't opened it yet, pa. We're going to open it together. This is what the laptop looks like when you first open it. I haven't opened it, it yet. As in, power on, pa. But this is what it looks like. We have this quick startup guide, I think. Because I have opened a laptop before and it also has something like this. But this one, it shows a lot more information. Like this one, the camera shutter, as you can see. It's talking about... This one, this is the camera shutter. Here in the lower left corner, it says the system will update when you boot the computer for the first time and thus the fan may produce a quite large sound. No need to worry about it. So let's try open it up. So there you go, here's the laptop when you first open it. Here's the laptop when you first actually open it and a video is playing on it just to show you what it actually looks like. This is the music video of On The Ground by Rosie from Black Tank and I'll use it as a model while showing you guys the laptop. And here are the laptop specs. The model of this laptop is the Lenovo ThinkBook 15 in 20 RW and it has an Intel i7 CPU and the Radeon 620 GPU. This laptop has the 16GB RAM, but you can upgrade it up to 24GB DDR4. It has 512 SSD storage and the operating system of this laptop is the Windows 10 Pro. And this laptop has a 15-inch Full HD display. The battery of this laptop can last up to 12 hours with the 95 watts Type-C adapter which is sold separately. So if you want a fast charger, it would be best to buy the Type-C adapter for the charger. Now coming along with the charger which is the USB Type-C is the display port and the other ports that you will see on the left side of the laptop which are these ones. And on the other side of the laptop which is the right side, you will see these different ports and slots like this hidden USB Type-A port and this 4-in-1 card reader. There's nothing on the back and like any other laptop, the top is all just its plain color which is mineral gray and the logo of the brand of the laptop which is Lenovo and on the edge you will see a ThinkBook logo near the back side which is unique to Lenovo ThinkBooks. 
For the keyboard and touchpad, there is a full-size keyboard with optional backlight. Also, with an integrated fingerprint reader and a smart button, you can log in or boot up instantly. The speakers are located at the back side of the laptop, both left and right. And that's it for the specs. Okay, so we're back in this room where we unboxed the laptop and it has been three weeks and I already got showed you guys the specs of the laptop, so it's time for my review. Now we're going to talk about the performance, portability, and price of the laptop if it's like good for you. Because I did my research and apparently those are the three things that you should consider when buying a laptop. So let's start with the performance. As I said a while ago in the specs part of this video, the laptop has the CPU Core i7 and the GPU Radeon 620, which are both great for heavy and long-term work. And which is also the reason why the laptop is very fast, very smooth, and just great for overall doing a job. I'd really recommend this laptop for using it for work at home or even those people who need to use it in their office. Next, for the portability part, I would say this laptop isn't really good for people who needs to carry their laptop from place to place frequently since this laptop is more than 2 kilograms, which makes it a little heavier than the usual laptop, which is I don't know the weight, but I think laptops like notebooks or netbooks or like MacBook Air, those type of laptops are a lot portable because they are lightweight. But if you need it for your office and you do have a car to put your laptop in, then I think there wouldn't be that much problem compared to a student who needs to, I think, walk to their classroom once the face-to-face -face pandemic face-to-face -face classes is ongoing now so maybe I'd give this a 6 out of 10 for the portability part and I didn't rate the performance part so I think I'd give the performance part a 10 out of 10 because the performance is really great and a lot better than the portability of the laptop so and now let's go to the price and actually I'm not really that much aware of the price because I just used this laptop I just borrowed this laptop for the sake of unboxing and reviewing it to you guys so I will be putting the price here once I ask the person who bought this or aware of the price is just here I'll put the prices now I can't really rate the price because I'm not really exactly sure how much it costs but I do have an estimated range in mind I think it's around 50 to 60k pesos uh, this is in Philippine pesos Overall thoughts and opinions about this laptop. I think this laptop is very great for work at home. That's it. Work from home. Work from home. And also maybe college students who have students, students. <laughs> college students who have a lot of workload and needs it on their computer. And maybe someone who needs it for heavy editing or gaming. Or just wants a laptop with great value. I think that is the end of this unboxing. And if I forgot to mention anything, I think I did, but I think I'm already done with everything now. I will put it in the description box or the comment section below. Thank you guys for watching. I will see you guys in my next video. Always remember, be a little kind of Bye!